a that's a step up galley kitchen with some of the world's oldest appliances including this ancient dishwasher then the dining room but also in the kitchen is the washer and dryer area with a little sink right here for that good cabinet space okay so dining room it's the back of the house then the living room and that door right there goes into the kitchen closet Christmas paper tchotchkes door attractive red car sitting in front okay now down the hall guest bathroom just your basic little bathroom you know the house was built in 1955 hence the tile and the colors um little bedroom looks to be hmm, 10 by 12 attractive wallpaper attractive balances you know from the 70s second bedroom with that real paneling this looks maybe to be 15 by 10 and then the master it has three closets two three that goes into the master bath and yes it has one of those small doors so you want to be in my movie mm -mm. i didn't think so okay for reasons that i don't understand so here we are back in the kitchen dining room area this is the master bathroom and there is that pink shower that is a step in you know here you go and then this is the door that goes back into the bedroom so this bathroom is really really narrow like it would be hard well let me just put it this way see i'm sta see where my feet are it would be really hard for daddy to miss the toilet like i'm not sure that he would have to even put the lid up put the seat up i mean but because she was older so it has the get me up off the toilet bar here and it has the bar in the shower um this could probably be removed he said the people who are doing the estate sales said that there was some of this pink tile still out in the little barn so if you just take this off and you could really and truly make it a walk-in and it looks like there'd be enough room in here for a shower chair too here's drew admiring it's a built-in Um, this den area that you can see down there is where the carport used to be. It's now like a den. And this goes out into like a back shed. Daddy could even put his tools out here 
plenty of room and it looks like a garage I guess you could park you could probably get a car in once they get all the other stuff cleaned off you know so like living room area over there of course I mean in that way kitchen well there's the kitchen there's the laundry that goes down into what used to be the garage and this room and then down the hall uh, first bathroom right there master bedroom is okay there's the first bathroom that's the master bedroom right there bedroom bedroom and the master bath actually shares a wall and plumbing hi right here like these two toilets and sinks pretty much back up on each other and everybody has a telephone nook right here because the house was built in 1955 the reason that you see all of this stuff is because they built this house basically this is what a house would look like if you and daddy had purchased a house in 19 62 when you got married and had lived here for the entirety of your marriage this is what you would be left with oh excuse me this is what Mary Kay and I would be left with room after room after room after room after room after room of stuff everywhere all over the place which is why they apparently hired an estate sale company to come and do the estate sale so um she has sarah coventry jewelry she has tupperware from the 70s she has lots of hats she was the he passed a while back she's the one who passed recently Lots and lots of hats. It makes me think of Grandma. Avon bottles. You know, all of this stuff. Okay. There's your tour. I hope you enjoyed it. Again, small, small master area. Might be possible to utilize that closet in some fashion to make a better door. Alrighty. Bye.